Yo, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to a new video. Today, we are joined by Classic. Hello. The guy that developed the cheats in the one minute versus 10 hour cheat video. And today, we're going to be remaking cheat menus with ChatGPT. I don't know how well this is actually going to work, and I don't know if ChatGPT is going to be at all accurate with remaking menus, but we're going to try our best and we're going to see what happens. I guess we'll just say make a C menu. Looks exactly like the photo. Okay. Okay, here it goes. Here it goes. Oh, it's moving. It's moving and grooving. Yeah, maybe we should try to train or the best one that it makes. We should try to train it to actually make it a, like a full functional menu. Blood. Let's see what ChatGPT cook. This should be aimware. And it's got errors. Hold on. <laughs> yes. N no. <laughs> no? Are you sure? <laughs> That's what are you talking about? The colors aren't even there. <laughs> it looks like aimware to me. It looks exactly like aimware, actually. Exactly. <laughs> It got the tabs. It didn't get the search bar. I don't think there's a search bar there, at least. The ones on the left are like like the fire mode being off, shift fire, defensive fire, or defensive warp fire. And on the right, I don't know why it put checkboxes because they're drop down menus in the actual menu. The weird part is you click it, so yeah. left clicked, it won't show till I update it. Well, it's janky. I mean, I, I that kind of checks out, though, to be honest with you. Next up, we have the fatality menu here. I have no faith in it for the fatality menu. I'm going to be honest with you. Let's add some more parameters here. Let's try to get it a little more specific, if you will, because I have a feeling that you could probably get it to do like actual checkboxes and stuff. What are you doing on your string chair, bro? Oh, <laughs> bored. You're wasted. It gave me a C++ file. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Uh, this doesn't look anything like it, bro. Okay, let me try to specify that we want the same colors and designs and everything. All right, here we go. The fatality menu. <laughs> what the hell? Name. Ah, yes. We have name ESP at least. Surely at some point it can get one of them right. You'd think so, wouldn't you? Okay, moving on to Facurity. We are going to say, I want a carbon copy of this menu written in C++ code. Every button on the menu should be functional. Oh, it's going crazy. Wait, 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 wait. It's actually going, cr it's going crazy style right now. Bro, it's 191 lines of code. All right, let me send it over. I wonder how accurate it'll get it because it can't really do icons or anything. We'd have to give it the icons, but like how close could we get it? And this is why I need classic here. I don't know how to fix any of this. It's kind of amazing to me that chat GPT isn't good enough yet to like not make mistakes. Uh, it's better. Wow. Look at those check boxes. That is beautiful. You know, it's actually better. Okay. So the binds, it made them buttons. What the, what is the trigger thing? I have not a clue. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if I could make it, make the person on the right. Can you add the hit scan hitbox priority? Make sure the player model is there, even if it's just blocks. Oh, whoa. Whoa. Okay. Whoa. Are you clicking on them? Yeah. Or is that just you hovering? No, that's me clicking. I feel like it's not bad. I mean, for AI, for AI, that is, you know, I mean, I don't know what that is supposed to be, but okay. Next up, we have Midnight. I'll now begin building. Is it even coding it? It doesn't. Where did it put the code? Oh, there it goes. What are you watching now? Cockroach. Okay. <laughs> okay, we have the code. We have the code the question is will it actually make something that is somewhat decent a lot less lines of code is it yeah losing a bit of faith yeah i am a little bit wow um what was this supposed to be midnight it sort of did it i yeah, wonder oops. if i can actually make it like add the tabs on the left let me see if i can do that because there's no tabs on the left it's just the screen i've reached my message limit oh no all right let's see let's see if i can do it i am ready it's coding it's it's typing it's typing it was done no nope, it's not done i was i was typing the prompt still would you like me to continue and add buttons and sliders add all of it oh i can feel it this one might be it the never lose one might actually pay it's asking if we can add icons and image previews example the ak-47 image how would it even do that in code oh it's a zip file bro it made a zip file okay that's a bit worrying i guess let me send you the zip file what the hell it's only five kilobytes why why does it have to be a zip file literally just this 125 lines as well okay i've i have zero faith <laughs> i have zero faith in this one Oh. Oh, that should be fair. Oh! 
That's actually somewhat close. I mean, this is literally just text. The slider works though, right? Yeah. Don't know what the value is, but... That's decently close. Can you make the box for the AK-47 and just make the AK-47 a square? Yeah. Hey, that's more accurate, to be fair. I did tell it to make a blue box. Can we just see how accurate we can get this? We could try. Ask it next to add the tabs in on the left side. Let's see if we can make this super accurate. Also include the red bar next to the box where the AK is and the four boxes below with the plus icons in them. I may have given it too much information. I guess we'll have to wait and see. How many lines of code did it actually add? 168. Zero errors. That's pretty good. Okay. To be fair, that looks quite cool. Okay. See, this is better. That's way better. Okay. Now I'm going to ask for it to make every single button functional. Okay. It looks the exact same as before. These are buttons. Oh, the tabs on the left still don't work, but everything else you can click on. Can you actually type a name in the yeah. name section? Can you type there? Yeah. Oh my God. Wait, what? That's kind of sick. You know what? I think this probably is the best that we've gotten so far. It did not like the button cancel. <laughs> cancel closes out of it. Yeah. Yeah, I guess it does. Okay, next up, I want to give it a really, really simple menu. We're going to give it the undetect menu. Ask it to be able to go up and down the settings with the arrow keys. Okay, let's see if it can perfectly recreate the undetect menu. Damn. Okay, oh. so... Whoa, whoa! It works. I'm going to make it so that the background is gray and the text is white. Ooh. Wow. That is actually impressive. Okay, all right, all right. We're going to try to get this, like, pretty close because I feel like this one could be pretty close. Come on, get the colors more accurate for us. Wow. Ooh. <laughs> that's wow. exactly what it looks like. That's exactly it. That's impressive. Dude, that's exactly what it looks like. That's like literally exactly what it looks like. Can you set the key? Like if you press right, like right arrow on the key and then press like K on your keyboard, does it actually set it? Yeah. Why does it say 75? Because that's the keys index. Oh, okay. So it is. Yeah, it's working. It's fully working. Wait, what? That's crazy. So if we, if we come over here. Here. K is 0x4B. Okay, I'm making one more. I'm making it do more work. What is, what is it going to do? Stop me? Yeah, it might uh, it might take over the world. It might take over the world. Be careful. The theme is still orange for some reason. I've told it to do that four times and it just doesn't. But it actually made the undetect menu. Yeah, man. Pretty perfectly, actually. I think we're going to leave it off there. That's probably the best that we're going to get as to accuracy between one menu to another menu. I mean, that's pretty good. Like that has every functionality of the undetect menu already there. I hope you guys enjoyed the video if you guys want me to do a part two to this we can always do more menu so leave your menu ideas in the description below whether it's a basic menu or really complex menu we'll try to build actual accurate menus next time if we do another one of these videos so if you guys like it leave a like comment down below you guys know the deal with that being said i'll see you guys next time